Welcome into Tomahawk Talk on the night of a Braves 5-3 victory over the Falmouth Commodores, ending their 11-game win streak. But Carson Field, there was a different head coach in the dugout tonight for the Bourne Braves. Yeah, that was Aaron Meyer. He's a graduate assistant at Missouri State University where he actually played before joining their coaching staff. Had a career-ending injury and made that transition over to coaching. He's done a nice job there and obviously a big win tonight. So that was definitely, definitely a confidence booster for him. And just a few years older than us, which is the crazy thing. Good for Aaron Meyer. I'd love to see that. And Joran, the Falmouth Commodores, as I mentioned earlier, 11-game win streak tonight ended here at Doran Park by your born Braves. Yeah. What kind of confidence can this bring the Braves? It's got to be huge to be a confidence builder for this team. This was the sixth longest win streak in the, the history of the Cape Cod Baseball League, when you think about it, the longest streak since 2002. And to, to beat this team on your home turf, especially when in all likelihood you're going to go in to play them in the first round of the playoffs as well, has to build a lot of the confidence for the Braves because last time we'll see Falmouth in the regular season for the playoffs, and they have to be feeling good about themselves. Really did a nice job building momentum to the playoffs. And a lot of what had to do with this victory tonight, Carson, was that clutch hitting that's been there and not there throughout the season. But tonight, it definitely was. Yeah, it really was on full display tonight. A couple of home runs from Jake McKenzie. A little bit of question whether those were fair or foul, but that's beside the point. And Judd Fabian, obviously, he had a home run. And then just a lot of guys, just a great order tonight. And I think this really could carry some momentum into the last few games of the year. So going into the last few games of the year, tomorrow we play at Brewster, 5 o'clock. We'll see you then.